Well, hello, hello. So, do you know those relationships where one person seems to be in like control of everything, as if they own the other person? I don't know. I'm just ranting today. Either one or both parties in the relationship are like, "Where are you going? Who are you gonna see? Why are you talking to that bitch? Oh, did you really have to take a shit at her house? You know, like they own the motherfucker person, like that's their child or something." And I look at it like this. When you're single, you know, you're doing you. You're in your own motherfucking world. You have your own shit. You doing you, boo-boo. You know, just having fun. When you're in your little boyfriend-girlfriend relationship, you know, it's an agreement. You don't fuck around, I don't fuck around. I likes you. This is what we doing. Unless y'all verbally said, hey, you can have some other poo tang or whatever the fuck you want to do with someone else. And I will give no fucks. Now, when you get married... It's a whole, it ain't whole different, it's same shit. It's a contract. But a lot of people forget, that shit can become null and void. Be like, bye bitch, don't need you. You know? And they're like, oh, you don't understand, you're not in love. You know, you don't, uh, you can't quite understand what it's like. I'm like, bitch, I don't think I want to understand. Because if that's what it is, then bitch, I will gladly die by my goddamn self. Like, for real, for real. Some people are like, oh, but when you get married, there's finances involved and all the other shit. Yeah, because it's contract. Me, personally, I couldn't deal with some overbearing motherfucking person. That's just me. I wish a motherfucker would try to tell me that I couldn't be with somewhere with somebody, talk to somebody at some place. Bitch, you can jog on a damn dick, and that's some truth for your little ass. Like, for real, for real. And some people are like, oh, but it's a give and take. Yeah. You can give that bullshit to someone else. Because, bitch, I'm not just going to lay down and take that. How about that? How about that? They say people that are, like, very overbearing and all that stuff have been hurt before. But, I don't know. That's what counseling's for, so... And it's not just guys. I've also seen girls do it. Guys be like, oh, who the fuck is that? Oh, I don't like that motherfucker. Oh, you know? And girls be like, oh, so you think that bitch is pretty? They be like sneaky about it, though. They're not as straightforward as guys are from what I've seen. I don't know, but I've seen some crazy ass nothing girls. Like, for real, for real. <laughs> like, girl, sit your hot pussy ass down. Don't nobody want you. Except for your boyfriend, which I don't even know why he wants you. Bitch, you crazy. A little rant about overprotective individuals in relationships. I don't know. Maybe it has to do with the history of their previous relationships. Or the sexuals is like the bomb.com. Or maybe their partner is like dressed up to the nines all the time and they look like grade A. I don't know. Just my little take on that. Anybody gonna see this show. I'm just ranting to myself. So yay me.